On here we got mainstream. We got Idom versus Wet Kunai. That what a set here. This is gonna be hype. I am very excited. Damn, so I just noticed Manon got the the Angela resize. Yeah, yes, and if you know, you know. I unfortunately know. It's okay. It's okay. Keep an eye out. <laughs> okay. Ha. Command throw? No. We're trying to clip him. I like that standing strong check in case that Wet Kunai wants to hold up and dive kick. And there it is. Speaking of which, but we was out of range. I found the first round today to actually uh, check Wet Kunai on his dive kicks, and it's the first round. So Wet Kunai is definitely going to take a little bit to adjust to this, but still some very cute damage right there. Nice little conversion there. When you're going through the pools and you're fighting a lot of those like lower seats, whatever, you finally fight like a top four seat, like someone like Idom was like, wait, I'm going to punch you for that dive kick. You're not getting away with that. It's like, oh, wait, I have to change up my game plan now. I have to, have to like think about the next step. Yeah, man. And that's yo. the next step right there. Big parry there. Get him all in the corner. Now, I was just about to highlight Ida. I'm like, yo, man, he really knows how to walk you down. And then that parry just came in out of nowhere. There we go. All right, pressure raw throw. No, not even. So I like that he goes for early uh, frame traps to represent that. Idom is known to try to check to see if you can, uh, if you're trying to throw. So like a wake up jab is definitely in Idom's future for sure on the defensive end. So I like that he went for the immediate crouch face. Wet cool nine. So the conditioning is there, but in terms of holding the lead and finishing the job, however, it's the, it's, it's the tough task. So we'll see what happens. Here we go. Wet cool nine starting out again with the aggression. Nice finding the low. Another opening as well, catching Idom, pressing the button there. Only two medals, of course. So it's got to be scary for uh, for Idom at least a little bit because you're down so much. Finally going to drag him back here into the vortex. Like, come over here, Boro. We're playing Mortal Kombat now. Uh -huh. Wet Kunai getting out of the corner there again with another cross up. This Ami just getting to, gets into the corner so flawlessly. That is what she do. She is a corner carrier for sure. That's her carrier of her phone. Corner. No, you got to react to those, man. Ooh, ooh. Idom's going to find a lot of damage off Ow. the... Burn out. We're going to spend it? No, should have spent it. Oh my god, don't let him get the burn out for free. Uh oh. Technical. Wow, we actually tech no wake up buttons. That was nice. kind of meaty enough though, so I see why. Nice oh, punish there. I like that with Kunai. What's Kunai? Silverware is moist. We mentioned it earlier, man, how he's had to mix up his gameplay. He's finally doing that, playing a lot more of that neutral place cami. Going for uh, punishing a lot of uh, Manon throwing up those errant normals. But Idom just getting in there saying, I need my damage, man. I got three medals. Now you're scared. That's that's the fear of God right in you right there. Uh, there we go. Uh, little by little, slowly but surely. Look at that low forward. Give us something. That looks sad. If she could just do that, and not two and one. Jeez. I guess that would have gave her too much Oki, huh? I don't want to think about it, man. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Okay. All right. Okay, Idom. Oh. And that's four medals. And we can to fight back. Finally, we're gonna find a dive kick there. I'm not expecting it, but we got critical art. We've got a lot of bar to spend here. Oh, this might just be able to get you back in the corner. Do we spend it here? No, we don't. We go for the mix-up. Oh, catching him standing up, but doesn't got anything off the jab. Mm. Like Kunai, if he finds it here, he's, he's able to got it. But death, oh, Idom, there we go. I close it out. But man, what a first round. What a game one. Hell of a stand short there from Idom. Sniped out the throw attempt from Wet Kunai. That was really good. Delay of the throw either. Oh, that was nice. And here we go. Let's get back into this. Starting out, honestly, like Wet Kunai adapting from that first round and bringing it all the way back. I definitely think there's a, we've got a we've got a set in our hands right here. Let's we'll see. Yeah, we'll, Wet Kunai. Yeah, even though we lost that last round, it was definitely nowhere near free. But we definitely made the adjustments to Zidon, so we need to step that game up emphatically. We think we, I definitely need to see more of the aggression catching Idom. He's doing a lot of that that fake pressure, if you will, the Banan shenanigans. Yeah. And Cami, if there's any character to punch that, Cami can do it. And Wet Kunai is doing a really good job, again, like calling out Idom, calling his bluff. That's what you gotta do against Manon a lot. You gotta call her bluff on a lot of this stuff. There we go, nice. 
corner there. Again, Kami looking for an opening, but here comes again, just burning it with the command grab. Nice stuff there. Hydon going for the grab as well, catching Wet Kunai, calling his bluff there. It burned out, but you go for the grab regardless. Oh. Do it again. That, that, that's how you go. Oh, mm -mm -mm. Wait a minute. Oh, she's burned out. Command throw. No. I do it that. You just go for that? I had no choice. I damn, you're nuts. Actually, he had no choice, to be honest with you. At that point, that was kind of like a checkmate for either or. It's either Wet Kunai would have read that and got a punish. Or just Wet Kunai gets incorrect. Both of them in burnout, too. So I like the choice there for Maidon. Hangs in there. And now he's at set point. Knocked down with a level three. Do not get hit with delay. He's looking for the counter hit. Set point, four medals online. Idom looking to close it out. Next That's hit. five medals. And yeah, uh, Wet Kunai, we need something crazy right now if we want to get back in this game. It's that doable, though. Considering that critical art is doable for Wet Kunai. Oh. Out of range, should have low forward. I don't know if that combo's wild. Didn't oh, wait a minute. Two hits away. Two hits. Well, actually, no, three hits. Uh oh. There we go find another grab. Wait a minute. It's doable. Uh, next, hit, next, hit, next hit. Next that hit. Next hit. Next hit. Does it? Yeah. yeah. Critical R. There we go. Just trying to open up this. Oh, goes for the parry there. Almost burned out here. Wait, Idom's got to be careful here. Another parry. Find another corner. He's burned out. The driver for the punch. <gasps> no punch there. Nah, I can't. It's negative two. Oh, wow. The patience from Idom that whole Man. round. That was crazy. I would have folded there at least three times. Idom closing it off perfectly. Two over Wet Kunai, but a very, very good set. That was great stuff there. Yeah, that very hard to punish uh, drive reversals in burnout. So if you're in burnout, somebody drive reversals on you. I think it is uh, relatively safe. I think it is negative two. Somebody correct me if yeah. I'm wrong. But uh, good stuff there, man. Well, yeah, I'm about to head up out, out of here. To